Hey guys, I have finally finished the kids' bathroom. I have decorated and fixed some holes that were in the ceiling and I wanted to show it to you guys. All right, so there was a hole in the ceiling that I have patched. So I need to paint over that. Um, I still have some patching to do. This is the bathroom and we're doing a big makeover in here. So I'm going to try and put a monorail painting on this wall. I do not know if I can do it, but we're gonna try. All right, so here's the update. I had a piece fall out, so I'm gonna have to patch this, um, which is frustrating, I thought I was done. And then the artwork, curtains, and then I think we've decided to leave this wall just as it is. And then there's the other artwork. So this is kind of our monorail themed bathroom. And then I am going to be doing this part of the bathroom next, which it's a disaster, but. And so when I go to paint this one and patch all the little holes and stuff in here, I'll go ahead and patch that. And then we're gonna paint it the same color. So I'll finish that up when I do this part. But first little section's done, now for the next. <laughs> So bathroom makeover is done for the most part. We got this fun shower curtain that just, it made me think of the monorail station for some reason. I don't know if they have a floor like this or what, for some reason when I saw it, I thought monorail. And it also reminded me of painting. So I thought it was perfect for in here. And then these are not matching towels, but I do have some that match. We just, they're not up right now. So I took down the bar that was here because it was always falling off the wall and I hung these hooks for the towels. They're just little hooks um, that I feel like are just a lot easier for the kids to use. And then eventually I'll probably add two more for the other two kids, but the other two always shower in my bathroom. So right now only two kids even use this. And then this is a painting that I did for this room it's inspired by the Polynesian and the castle and then the monorail. Um, and I know it's not perfect, but I enjoy it and I had fun creating it. And then I decided just to do a simple kind of side curtain. And these are actually like paper, but this window is a weird shape and you have to special order shades and it's going to take a while before they come in. So I did this for now because this is a bathroom and we have to have a covering on that window. So this is kind of a temporary fix until I can get some real shades in here. I decided to leave this wall blank and the color is not this, well there, that's probably more of the true color. It looks a little weird in some lighting. Um, it's more of like a off, a greenish blue. I don't know. It looks weird in the picture. And this, these two rooms are actually the same color, even though they look different. Um, and then here's another painting that one of my kids did, or it's a drawing. She used crayons, but, and it's of a monorail. And then you come in here and we just have this sink. And then we have some more artwork. Oh, that's crooked. Um, this is another painting I did, which I can't decide if I like it or not, but it's in here. <laughs> and then we just have like a watercolor. And this is one that Disney actually gave us um, when we toured the Riviera. So.
So that we did not do. Um, and then here's some more family artwork. My son did one and my husband did one. So this bathroom has a lot of family art, which is special to us. And there you go. And then I went ahead and hung a towel rack here because I thought it'd be useful for the sinks and stuff. And then I need to get out all the matching towels. But for the most part, the kids' bathroom is done after living here for seven, almost seven years. We finally have fixed the hole in the ceiling and, and finished off the bathroom. Thank you so much for watching. Please be sure to like this video and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you all in my next video. Bye!